Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install any Rico printer driver in Windows 11 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First, go to the any web browser that you like. I'm going to the Google Chrome. I'm going to the Google Chrome. In a search, I type Rico. Then whatever your printer model number is, whatever type your printer model number, I type my printer model number 16M1600LE printer driver and hit enter key on my keyboard. I type Rico, then my model number and printer driver or download and code the first link. First link is from the support.rico.com. Open the first link and official website is open. It's automatically select Microsoft Windows 10 64 bit. Windows 10 64 bit drivers are 100% work with our Windows 11. And if you want to specific Windows 11 driver, then click on this, choose other OS and go to the here. Here we find Windows and Windows Server. Click at here and we can also go to the Windows 11 from here also. Same drivers from here or from the our Windows 10 64 bit. I click on this printer driver, click on your printer driver, wait for a few seconds, our download is started. Here we find our download. And after that download is completed, click on downloads and click on show in a folder, click on show in folder. Minimize it and drag this setup file to desktop. Close it. Here we find our Rico printer driver and we are going to install this driver. These drivers are actually a zip file and we are going to unzip this zip file and manually install this driver. That is very easy. Right click on it. Here we find show more options. Click on extract files, click on extract files, click on the OK and it's extract the driver on your PC or laptop. Here we find double click on this newly created folder, double click on it. Double click on it and here we find the, our drivers. Close it. Next step is install it. Go to the start. Type printers and scanners. Click on the type printers and scanners and click on printers and scanners. In a printers and scanner, we find many options. Go to this option, add a printer or scanner. Click on add a device. Click on add a device. Wait for a few seconds and in a few seconds, new option is pop up. The printer that I want isn't listed. Add a new device manually. Click on add a new device manually. Close it. In a add a printer, we find many options. Go to the last option. Add a local printer or network printer with manual settings. Select last option. Click on the next. Here we find existing port. It is the most IMP part of this whole installation and go to the port in a port click at here and select any usb port that you find usb 001 usb 002 usb 003 004 005 select any usb port that you find select your usb port and click on the next next option is go to the have a disk go to the browse go to the desktop on a desktop scroll down and find our printer driver or the newly extracted folder double click on it Double click on this folder. In this folder, we find .inf file. It's only show the .inf file. It is not show any file. Select any file that show on these folders. Okay, select that and click on this open button. Click on OK. Here we find our printer name. If you have multiple printers, then select your proper printer. If sometimes series printer, sometime multiple printer and sometimes single printer. I select first printer. You can select also second printer also. My printer is 1600. So I select first and click on the next. Give any name. I give LE. You can give any name that you like and click on the next. It takes some time depending on the your driver size. After that, here we find two options. First is the do not share and second is the share with the network printers or the network PCs. I go with the do not share this printer and click on the next. If you want to print a test page, then click on a print a test page or click on a finish. Next is the check our printer is properly installed or not. That is also very easy and simple. Go to the start 
and type printers and scanners and click on printers and scanners. In a printer list, if you find your printer name, that means your Rico printer is properly installed in Windows 11 PC or laptop and it's work 110%. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.